trust me, because my ears say she carry money. Jesus! Then I want to go back in the past. Mm-hmm. Boy, everybody saw the mm-hmm. picture. Yes. Hold well, on, it did, it did too hard to go down your throat. Like, no, you yo. know. <laughs> yeah, boy. The fact that, you know, she's out there having sex with all of the DJ enemy them, the picture came out. I just just never want to offer with him pre this so viewers and subscribers welcome back to another upload and in this upload you don't know we are going to talk about lisa hyper and the shelly tea time show i understand she do an interview and she talk about bag of things and even things where people they know and a lot of people are wonder if the things that she attack where she know if a lie or a truth evil about shawty so viewers and subscribers guess what leave a like on the video subscribe if for the first time you watch this channel and also hit that notification bell so i'm gonna play some voiceover from the interview and then we'll have a discussion so the run out of house was true then trust me shot of flee trust me because my ears say she carry money in there jesus jesus in that in a females the one good good house where i'm taking money and bill me all you say she take your money and mine man too. Jesus Christ, the show. They might go crash YouTube now to us. Ah, oh, Jesus. It hurt me. So all when him vague members are from me at five, my have him back, you know. So me I got always have him back. Some things him now gotta understand. So that's Lisa Hyper talking on the situation with Shati and Vibes Cartel said so Vibes Cartel run out Shati out of the house. You understand? And she even mentioned she ears say she a take the man money, mine man. And remember, she even ears say a run vibes cartel run out shorty. You see me say this is no defense of shorty because me no know shorty, understand? And me not swear fear like me not swear for no woman. Cartel gone a prison from I think our 11 until now. It would be understandable if Shati had do her little thing on the side, but if she had do her little thing on the side, she had do it well discreet because, like, literally, nobody have no proof our Lisa I pass it. And as she said, a ear, she hear it. You understand? So, my understanding of this whole thing and my opinion on it. After the other day, them spread the whole rumors about Shati and Popcorn. Everybody come out and I say, yo, Ray, that go on, that go on. Vibes Cartel actually came out and posted Shati like him and Shati good. You understand? So watching the tea time show, I think Shelly do a good job. And she make mention it that it is a mix-up show. You understand? So while them state it on the interview, say it seems like Shelly did a deal with Vibes Cartel. Lisa Hyper mentioned she, she did a deal with Vibes Cartel and obviously Shati was the wife at the time I don't know if she had a wife still but my understanding from it I just feel like say they don't really like Shati like that so definitely anybody who have liquor something to say or mix up or whatever they want to put it them go say it about shawty you understand so as me say it's no defense for shawty but knowing say two girls not like one person you're not gonna expect female if you say nothing good about that person wearing if i chew them attack the people them want the proof you understand but differently from that a lot of people go say yo a fake news a gossip and i just bring them one bring down shawty you understand as me say me don't put nothing past shawty if she had do her thing on the side she had do it well discreet because nobody no man now come forth and say yo what you mean beat it you see me the other day they must say yo pop can do this pop can actually come out and big up shawty in a, a respectful way where they would say yo nothing not happen so viewers and subscribers tell me your opinion down below in the comment section on that part I want to go back in the past. Mm-hmm. Boy, everybody saw the mm-hmm. picture. Yes. Hold well, on. It did, it did too hard to go down your throat. Like, no, you know. No. no. Remember, said, remember, said, remember, said, them time there. Them time. What me did actually do? Why you see the picture text, so, you know? Because I see me see say, me never willfully take the picture, you know. I see me see say, the phone I snap, you know. And I get up back for grab the phone from him. Oh, so him take the picture. Exactly. And who release it? Him say I know him, but 
me feel like him because I'm the jealous over somebody who I never even did involve with. So I feel like him and at the end of the day, that's where I lost all respect for him. So only if he's a youngster and even if he's a youngster, maybe you would have seen the picture we released with Lisa Hyper where she basically a DJ upon a mic, not an official mic but the mic mic, you understand? So at the time a lot of people never knew a old person she did a do it to, there was speculation say a vibes cartel but no, in this interview she actually I say yo, I did him and she never take the picture like directly him she realized say picture did a snap and she realized say she have to take with the phone and something but it already catch you understand so shelly asked her say who release it and basically she has said at that person which is she at her vibes cartel release it because vibes cartel thing she did involve with somebody where she actually never did a talk to you so, I mean, I say, and if you say vibes cartel release that picture Basically, a lot of people look at it normal, but for me, I look at it like you'd actually disrespect Vibes Cartel. Then, you see what I Because if a man nowadays get that bro and take picture and release it, that's just childish. You understand what I say? So the fact say, she, she say a Vibes Cartel release it, well, I don't know if it's true. We don't know how the picture did release, and even she not really confirm she said she believe that means that she have little doubt you understand so definitely after the video after the picture release she basically stated that she lose a lot of respect her father did see it her mother and basically it hurt all of them because her father go work and people ask him about it and all him something you understand what i mean saying at the next part when i go make you listen you definitely can hear she explain that after the picture came out. I just, you know, just never want to offer do with him. And it's not only because he hurt me, it's because he hurt my father, my mother, and my family as well. You understand? Because my father have to go work. People are going to ask him about them something. Oh, you have to put me out like that, make my father see that. So he so betrayed that, you? Yeah, so yeah and that's why i stay far from people because if me can know somebody from me i'm five years old we can do me that we are stranger we do to me so you hear it for yourself and if you want to get a full understanding of everything where she had talked say you can definitely go check it out over the shelly tea time show and basically form your own opinion but my opinion is majority of the things that she talks say maybe some true but like I think Lisa Ipaf go come with certain proof to prove some of the things them, especially where she, where she basically has said about Shati and all of that. You understand? Because when I gather from this interview, she and Vibes Cartel not talk, she and Shati not talk, and Shelly and Shati no deal. So basically anything where Lisa Ipaf said about Shati or Vibes Cartel, I guess she don't really care because them no deal. You understand what I say? So as me even said some of the things that she said she said she even hear it so she not have concrete proof either you understand but definitely the whole picture exposed she said it really hurt her it hurt her career hurt her family it hurt her mother and her father you understand and a lot of people me think people that recover from them thing that by now like see them uh person where she used to do interview near milk i think after she, a, a picture same way where they release for them say a vibes cartel same way fear career like you just put on pals i think she had some interview same way but i think upon youtube something but she not really out there like that again you understand but in 2023 me feel like say people just let go that and just know say yo i eat i in thing and it a go on, you understand? So viewers and subscribers, leave your honest opinion down below in the comment section. And this topic, tell me what you honestly think based on the interview. I'm going to basically play a last voiceover and you tell me what you think down below in the comment section. Well, me and her know what she had do. Um, the fact that, you know, she's out there having sex with all of the DJ enemy them and you know and a babe like say she a goody two shoe and she had this perfect baby mother worst baby mother i'm gonna care if him want vex jesus 